subscribe to Movie Learnings and click on the bell icon to get notification on all new travel videos. We all love it when we go shopping and find that my favorite store is having a huge sale. Stores want to keep their shelves and racks filled with clothing and accessories, but they get new merchandise so frequently that eventually, items that aren't selling must be put on clearance in order to move it out the door. If you know exactly when an item will be on sale, you can decide whether you want to wait to buy it on the cheap, or you think it's worth the extra money to buy it beforehand. Don't get me wrong, stores want you to pay top dollar for the goods on the shelves. That's why they put higher priced items right at the front of the store, and sale and clearance items way in the back. But just because a jacket is 30% off doesn't make it any less fashionable, does it? 1. Wait 6 to 8 weeks. The typical retail store lets a new item hang out on the shelves for 6 to 8 weeks before it's marked down. Merchandise in retail stores is ever changing, so shop owners can't afford to have old items languishing on the racks and taking up space. Furthermore, after 6 to 8 weeks of buying, there might only be a few of a specific item remaining, hardly enough to take up room on a display. Therefore, it's moved to the sale or clearance section, usually at the very back of the store. There, it can be lumped with other sale items to be snapped up by savvy shoppers. 2. Thursdays are best. If you want first dibs on a pair of shoes you've been eyeing, your best bet is to try shopping on a Thursday. Stores know that most people come to the mall or the shop on the weekend. So they begin preparations on Thursday to mark down old merchandise and rotate new merchandise into the store. By shopping on Friday and Saturday, you might score a great deal, but you might also have a limited selection, that's not good if you want something specific. By shopping on Thursday, you can have the best selection paired with the best prices to snag the item that you desire. 3. Ask Around I once found a dress on sale that I loved, but they didn't have my size. Instead of leaving empty-handed, I asked one of the retail associates if she could check around to see if any of their other store locations had the same dress in stock. As luck would have it, there was another, and the store had it shipped to my house for free. If you see something you want but the pickings are slim, ask to see what the store can do for you. In many cases, the salespersons want to keep the sale in-house, so they'll bend over backwards to make sure you're happy. While clearance buys are often limited, most stores have inventory elsewhere, so if you really want a great deal, it's worth it to ask. You can also check smartphone shopping apps to see if they have the item in stock online. 4. Know the return policy. Clearance buys are often a great deal. But it's important to read the fine print. Finding a shirt for $5 is great, but not if you can't return it if it doesn't fit. Always read or ask about the clearance return policy. In most cases, all clearance jewel resales are final, but plenty of stores offer store credit in lieu of a refund for clearance clothes. Stores do not want to see out of season merchandise boomeranging back to the store since they need space for new wares. That's why most clearance return policies are pretty short, usually around 14 days. 5. Know when not to buy. You're going to pay a premium price if you shop too early or during the wrong month. And some items never go on sale. High-end designer shoes and accessories are usually pretty constant in price, especially if the item doesn't technically have a season. Final word when you're smart about buying during sales and clearances. You can dress the same as your friends, only for much cheaper. It's the best way to stay in the loop without completely busting your budget. When is your favorite time to shop? Do you have any other tips to get the best deals? So please share us. Till then happy and safe shopping. Thank you for watching. Please do subscribe, like, share and comments this video with your friends.